This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Danielle Davis with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Many of those who protested in Omaha last year anxiously watched as the judge read Tuesday's verdict. Derek Chauvin on all three charges in the murder of George Floyd guilty. Some calling it a historic moment for a police officer to be held accountable, but many say they still have concerns. We also have to be cognizant of how low the bar is for us to be exclaiming such positive emotions outpouring through the cities. We saw this clear cut murder. While this is one small win, um, this is not uh, justice. This is accountability and there is more work to do. Several of those we spoke to say George Floyd's death pushed them into activism. There is a George Floyd Justice Policing Act in the works that is aimed at preventing police misconduct. An Omaha's police chief spoke out against Derek Chauvin's actions last May, and then yesterday he talked about what the verdict can mean here. Chief Todd Schmatterer's statement said, quote, let's use this moment as an opportunity to find common ground for police and communities all across this country, as well as justice served. He added Omaha has made great strides when the community and OPD have worked together, and OPD would like to use this moment to further commit to our community. And on 3 News Now, Chief Meteorologist Mark Stitz will continue with that mix of sun and clouds the rest of the afternoon, but keeping it cool, highs only around 50 degrees. Overnight tonight, we get cold, so continue to protect those more sensitive plants that you have outside. We drop down to 29 for your Thursday morning. Tomorrow afternoon, more clouds build in after some morning sunshine, eventually giving way to some isolated rain in the afternoon. Better chance of rain, though, and it will be light Thursday night. Highs, though, a little bit better near 56. Friday, we're mostly cloudy as we get up to 60, and then Saturday, we put the warm up on hold, staying near 60 to start the weekend. But then we really warm up. Stronger wind kicks in out of south Sunday and Monday. So low 70s Sunday and Monday, low 80s before some scattered rain showers Tuesday drop us back to the 70s. It's big cookie combo time. Get my big chocolate chip cookie along with the medium classic combo and the medium one topping pizza for a limited time. Big cookie combo, Godfather's Pizza, do it.